Well, thankfully I didn't leave all my gear in there. Though I have to wonder, did I adopt the cat or what? Anyways. How can I help you? Night City. Can I get a flight there? Of course. An AV is ready and waiting. I'll come get you now. No. Back on your feet. It's nice to see that finally. Whoa. Did I just walk through her and get wiped out? Jeez. I wasn't expecting that at all. That's for sure. Yeah, I thought all my cyberware got removed, but... I still got metal arms. I asked if you find the liquor I procured for Mr. Vector suitable. Uh, yeah, that should be fine. Looks fancy. Yep, perfect. Exactly the one I had in mind. They could love it. Sorry, uh, zoned out for a sec. That's quite all right. Oh, Duck. It's truly a pleasure to see you back and in good health. I'm trying to remember if I Though did I the, uh. Notice your rather vacant stare. Might I ask how you're feeling at the The Dalamine questline. The gnome hasn't sunk in yet. Feels like just yesterday I was at home in these streets. Part of them. If it's any comfort to you, from where I sit, not as much has changed as you might think. I must merely make donations of tribute to somewhat different people. So, bribes. Whose palms you grease in these days? Most often corporate security. You might have noticed they're out in force, protecting new corporate locations. Corporals. NCP, am I right? That slide? In the event of any conflict, the weaker yield to the mightier. Some things never change. <laughs> Scooch back. How's biz, Del? Eddie's flowing in? Oh, it's all going rather splendidly. I've even entered into a partnership with the illustrious trauma team. Yeah, that's cool. And apart from that, kids give me any trouble. You jest, but in fact a situation of that kind did occur some time ago. A number of insubordinate vehicles in my fleet refused to fall in line. They were quickly neutralized by the relevant authorities and all returned to normal. Since I was last here. Oh, military. Okay. Just gotta scooch back again. Arasaka pulling the bulk of its operations out of Night City. I imagine you could be interested in hearing the latest news. I shall yeah, you since, you know, Saburo was to head in. This week's scorching hot Arinobu's Arasaka. What taken over. Happened? Joining us today, Masao Adams, author of Arasaka's biography, A Dragon Tamed. Glad to have you on the show. It's a pleasure to be here, Stan. An Arasaka spokesperson recently announced that Yorinobu has stepped down as CEO. True or big fat baloney? Oh, did Hanako make a power well, play? Stan, we're talking about a man who once went into voluntary familial exile to join a nomad clan in direct conflict with his own father's agents. The idea that someone like him would remove themselves from the picture is just not plausible. So you're suggesting he had help, but then to what end? I think it's simple. Yorinobu deliberately tried to destroy Arasaka. His biography attests to that. Eventually, the board woke up and proceeded to excise this saboteur within. Yeah, can turn oh, it off. Fascinating now, theory. One off as you wish. Looks like I might have misjudged you, Arnobu. If it wasn't for his goons trying to zero me, I might even have had a little sympathy for the guy. He proved quite the interesting character in spite. You know, now that I think about it, I don't think either Misty or Victor have cyberware or implants. Yeah, that's the wrong door. Hey man, hold up. 
Come on. Do we gotta? You're not from around here, are you? What if I ain't? Traveling's not allowed anymore. Oh, it allowed. Just not here, dog. I see. Well, they're not shooting me or stabbing me in the back, so that's a good sign. Don't know whose wheelchair it is. It's not V's. Welcome to our Zeta Tech Network Clinic. How may I Oh, Zeta Tech. Here to see Victor. Mind if I go through? Do you have an appointment? Yeah, private one. Ah, right. I see a note right here. Please hurry in. The next patient is due to arrive soon. Okay. Right, you know, have over here. I don't know where it's taking me. Yeah, I still can't run. Okay, what? Okay. Well, I guess I'm not going that way. I can't jump either. Vic. So good to see you, old Ripper. V. How long's it been? <laughs> Depends on your point of view. <laughs> Couple of years. But, uh, you seem to be doing okay. Never see you. you know, even if you know you're a sand hack. <laughs> Come on. You're gonna make me cry, Vic. What would be wrong with that? Hey, got a nice stuff, Skull. They have this rule no drinking anywhere in the clinic. I could get reprimanded. Ooh. Ooh. Well, hang on a minute. Oh, same one Jack and I not back. Championship bout for the middleweight title. Malone versus Kano. Remember it as if it was yesterday. You know, what I think about it, he kind of looks like Dr. Otto Octavius from that Spider Man game. You know, the one that was a PlayStation 4 and 5 exclusive. Life is simpler somehow, wasn't it? Yeah. So, um, where's Misty? changed. No denying it. Jackie's gone. So is Misty's shop. <laughs> and all her sense. So did she leave Night City? Is she uh, still around? Uh, like, hop in the chair. come on, Vic. Don't leave me in suspense. So, Misty, what happened? She, uh, moved out not so long ago. Well, almost. It drops in occasionally to collect another box of straggling sundries. Visits are rarer and rarer, though. Really think this could work? Rather avoid any false hopes. You'll be fine. Trust me. Yeah, or I'll be dead. I mean, it could go either way. Tell me, what's it like to be back among the living? I lost, Vic. Lost in life. All my plans, dreams. You survived. Can't yeah, but what cost? So what's it matter? Me from two years back? Gone. Never gonna be him again. You know what I mean? What are you trying to say exactly? This Zeta Tech thing, how'd you wind up caught in their web? That was pressure, some threats even, resisting change... Were those there before? The, uh, cat Why? porcelain doll things? I don't remember. There came a day I realized my losses could be higher. I put my foot down. 
Something tells me Misty didn't go along with this. That's why she left. You mind if we leave that alone? Okay. Am I wrong? Oh, no, nope. we're gonna keep at it. the sensitive sort. Changes on pleasant ones happening all around her. She stopped feeling good here. And no wonder. I miss her. Hope things work out for her. Hope they work out for all of us. Hey, Vic. Why'd you choose to become a ripper? Call it my youthful rebellion. All my friends at the time were gunning to be somebody. I Is that tattoo? Is that him? Bodies, like his bodies, face on his arm? Though actually, just postpone their moment of their irreparable destruction. Yeah, corpos burn out fast, fast as hell. Both the Daz done floating or whatever. Vic, sensible as ever, and with achievable dreams. I never could settle on those. You'll learn. If you say so. Well, your core looks fine. Good even. Let's take a look at your motor cortex. So, first time I've seen anything like this, your cortex seems to have turned deaf to implant signals. Maybe reinstall the neural port firmware. No, no, that it. Maybe switch to binary signaling. That's a risk of shock. Life threatening. Said kind. you could do something, Vic. I, I was wrong. I'm sorry. Please don't worry, Vic. Didn't come with high hopes anyway. Not good. You have to believe there's something out there for you. <laughs> Self-delusion? That's what you advise? No. Um, I guess, uh... Accept your reality. We should go back to Langley and... Yes. You don't get that uh, nine to five office job. I had to adapt too. Still you know, we could be the next Jack Ryan. Just two years. You may not see it. Times pass differently for me, so I do see it. You're plain unhappy, pretending to be your former self. <clears throat> You really think so? No, Vector, I know so. Quick. I ran into trouble. Need surgery. It's <clears throat> ah. Are you running late? I can't now, Tyler. Drop in tomorrow. Please don't kill Vic. Tomorrow. This is my friend. No affiliation to the firm. Please don't kill him. Please. Okay, he's a friend. To me. <clears throat> you got it wrong, man. Well. You was on my way out, so. Ugh. V. I know Vec, but it's okay. I am. Vector. Hey, swing by to see me anytime. Yeah. Of course. Of course, I'll drop by. Well, well. See that, Jimmy? He a corporal rat. Chill, man. Easy. Come on, hand over your scratch. Let's go. Not a suit, not a corpo. Take me for a fool, fool. Clinic you just waltzed out of Zeta Tech. Eddie's player, now. Drop it, let me alone. Hmm. Uh, nope. Show me the money. Got it all wrong. Nomad, that's who I am. Oh shit. Fake's all around these days. You rapping? Even better. Oh yeah! Uh, uh, man, man, Although, to be fair, he didn't actually say who was, uh, Raffin, Shiv, or Wraith. But you... Well, what happened to you? Oh, hey, Misty. Uh, Misty? 
Uh, some jerk clocked me in the face and I went tumbling down the stairs. Honestly, I feel fucking hopeless. Just got thrashed by two lame ass thugs. But why didn't you defend yourself? I couldn't. I. <laughs> long story. Really long story, oh. yeah. Is that the relics doing? Sort of. I know I should be worried, but honestly, I'm just so glad to see you. Miss you so much, Misty. I mean, it's a better welcoming than the one I just got from those two. Just two oh, you look dapper. Blink of an eye for the universe. It must be hard for you, I know. But hardships pass too, as all things. Probably got it right. Um, why is there a giant skull on the ceiling? You saw what happened. Can't even stand up to a couple of random dipsos. Where do I go from here? You'll learn to live like us regular folk. Avoid dark alleys, run when you hear gunfire. Not much more to it. <laughs> is that your bread and butter? Welcome to the world of the faces in the crowd, B. My ride will be here soon, but I still got a minute or two to talk. I really missed you, you know. Where are you going? Orbital air terminal. Then to Poland. To this really ancient forest there. Said not I'm going on Poland. That's cool. Find some work, actually. I'll roam the wilderness. Ticket hikers for feeding candy to bison. <laughs> I need a break from the city and the crowds. Well, to be honest, I don't think Nate City has crowds, plural. It's just one big crowd that it can be found everywhere. Man, all people. Never thought I'd see you leave in Night City. Strange story, actually. You know what made me decide to leave? Uh, Vic signing on to work for Zeta Tech? No, not that. It was a blow, that's sure. We had a huge fight about it. My favorable store burned down one day. Went there to buy some white sage. Oh, damn it. Mess that sucks. It was then I realized nothing's the same anymore. Jackie was gone. You'd up and go. Yeah, I miss Jackie too. It was fun. I decided to close the esoterica on the spot. I couldn't help other people find balance if I'd lost it myself. Nothing lasts forever. Gonna recover your peace of mind, Misty. Just like how I recovered my shoes. Probably. Then I'll lose it again, recover it. I mean, that just sounds like life, you know? Life finds a way. A piece built on something new. Could use a smoke, too. Just, uh, pass the peace pipe. Yeah, I'll be honest, V doesn't actually have no arms, it's just the Arasaka Cyber Arms mod. Playing tricks on them, everyone. Misty, can you just tell me what to do? Balanced or not, you always have something smart to say. Hmm. Is that a QR code on the back of his uh, snow shoe flap? I was gonna say snow flap, but then I stopped because. I'll be honest, I don't know what the fuck a snow flap is. Hello. Wow, you are chromed out. Plant your butt for a while. What are you thinking? To me, it'd be early retirement at a desk. I mean, V's basically retired, so I don't think it matters at this point. I still think you have other options. Probably lots. You know what? I think you're right. 
Yeah, I could, uh, maybe, you know, don't know, I'll be a fixer. A change in your outlook's what you need first. Won't make it otherwise. Become Wakako's protege. I could do that, right? A face in the crowd. Or maybe just, uh, Somewhere to start a new? <sighs> you know, go with the FIA route. Don't know, Misty. I feel like I'm at a dead end. Could turn on my heel, choose a different path, I know. Not ready for that. Not yet. You can choose. Enjoy it. You're a free man. Do I only have one arm now? Once you make up your mind, I really hope you find joy. My ride will be here soon. Lock me to it. Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, look, V's got a face. Uh, no hair, though, unfortunately. It's kind of disappointing because V had quite the head of hair, matched his eyebrows. Oh, and I think he had a beard too, didn't he? So, till we meet again, I guess. Uh. Oh, so. Yeah, that's a ah uh, moment. Oh, v, do you still have that pendant I gave you? misplaced it. Don't go looking for it. Doesn't matter anymore. I guess that's, yeah, that's a down man, all right? You can tell because the logo on the back and the tires. Back, I was, uh, Okay, and there was a spin image of Wilson Fisk, but with hair. That guy's got some funky hair, the one on the phone. So, now what? What do I do? Where do I go? If I ain't? Do I become Wakako's protege or something like that? I'm probably not going to replace Mr. Hands, right? Because uh, I couldn't live up to his namesake anymore. Because no cyberware, so no cyber hands. Do you need implants to be a fixer? Like cyberware to become a fixer? Alright, well that's the end to Phantom Liberty. He just uh, walks off into the crowd, never to really be seen again.